guys, welcome back to Little Bless Nest. My name is Stephanie. If you're new here, it's been a while since I opened a video from my car, <laughs> but we're out, I'm out doing a little shopping today. I'm doing a little something different in today's video. We're doing a little living room refresh, but it's not on my living room. It's on my friend Ryan's living room. Um, we've been trying to just cozy up his space a little bit. It's typical like bachelor pad-ish. So we're just gonna maybe get some throw pillows and some lamps. I recently picked up some new curtains for, to put in there for him. I got them from at home. When I was in there, I saw these and thought it would match really well with his, like he's got some artwork that he picked up that he really likes and they went well with that. So I'll show you those. Also, I'm really excited to be working with FlexiSpot in today's video. This is the first time I've worked with them, but I've seen their products and everybody that I've seen do reviews of them and things like that have always had good things to say. So I was really excited when they said they wanted to send me a recliner because we really need a recliner in Ryan's living room. Um, you guys know he has a teenage boy. Right now, all he has is the new sofa in there. So it's really nice to have another place for somebody to sit and we're not all crowded up on the sofa together when we're watching TV or a movie or something. So that's going to be great. I'm going to show you guys that. But for now, I'm going to run in uh, Bell's Outlet. I think that's what you call it and see if I can find like some throw pillows. Uh, maybe a, a throw blanket. I don't know, just a few things to make it look a little cozier. I've added in a few plants, so I'm going to share all that with you. I hope you enjoy it. It's a little different, but something, I don't know, just a little something. Maybe y'all are getting tired of looking at my living room. <laughs> Let's get in here and see if we can find something good. So I'm going in here to look for lamps specifically and they didn't have as many as I thought that they would I did like this one it has the terracotta kind of color around the top which is in the colors that Ryan has but then it also had blues and that just really it wasn't the right color blue and then I saw these with the green and kind of like a gold color in it I didn't pick them up immediately but I knew that I did like them I went and looked at the rest of the lamps and they just didn't have anything else that really stood out to me I also ran across this little kind of like an entertainment center and it was marked down because it is damaged right here at the bottom of the door you can see the door doesn't close very easily if you kind of lift up on it and close it it's fine but it was marked down to 150 I don't remember what the original price on it was, but it was still a little a little high, in my opinion, for something that's damaged, especially. Another thing that I'm looking for is a few large baskets. He has a, it's kind of like a baker's rack, I guess that's what you call it, in his living room that a friend had given him, and he has his TV displayed on it. And I thought some nice big baskets would look good down at the bottom of it and be a place to store different things and maybe Riley's toys things like that speaking of Riley I almost picked up this little wolf sign to hang in the kitchen above his food bowl I thought it would be cute to hang like a leash on and things like that it was 10 bucks but I ended up not getting it I was trying to stick to my budget and to the plan I did pick up these baskets I really like them they have like a leather look handle i'm sure it's not genuine leather i don't think but it looks nice and i think this will serve its purpose we could put riley's toys and stuff in here when he's not playing with them and just whatever else he needs to store and put out of sight so i did get the big one and then one that's just a little smaller i think it was like three dollars cheaper or something like that but i thought they would look nice sitting side by side and yeah i think that'll work out when I got back, I did a little tidying up, ran the feather duster over all the furniture. Much like me, he is not great at dusting, but I told him it doesn't look any worse than the dust at my house, which is facts. Um, I put the baskets down here on the bottom of this bake baker's rack, and it really did help to disguise some of the cords and things that were there. I want to thank FlexiSpot again for supporting my channel and sponsoring today's video. They sent me their FlexiSpot Power Swivel Rocker Recliner XR4. It comes in two boxes and is in four pieces. It's so super easy to assemble. It took maybe 15 minutes. It could, I could have easily done this myself, but Ryan did it for me so I could video. Um, you can see here the little metal rails on the side 
the arms just slide right onto that and then the back is pretty similar it's there's no tools required no screws nothing all you do is simply slide it together and attach the cords for the power because this is a power um, recliner we really loved how easy the assembly was we also loved all the different functions of the recliner like the how you can adjust the headrest one of my favorite features of the chair is how it swivels because the way Ryan's living room is set up, you can swivel it around to face the couch or you can swivel it back around and face the TV. So it works out really great. Another great feature is that you can charge your cell phone right from your chair. We love the beautiful dark brown color and the fact that this is made from a water resistant synthetic leather so it's really cool and it's super easy to clean and wipe down. Ryan has really been enjoying this chair. He loves sitting and relaxing while he's watching TV. He loves rocking in it. It's just very relaxing and enjoyable. If you'd like to get a flexi spot recliner of your own, you can use my exclusive code XR430, which will give you $30 off and free shipping. So be sure not to miss out. been talking recently about getting a record player and come to find out he has all these old records from when he was growing up that he listened to all the time a lot of them were passed down to him so we're going to be getting that pretty That's soon domino mm -hmm. <laughs> you'd be surprised like this was you wonder why i like blues and old music so much this is your collection from when you were growing up right well pretty much it was handed down to me and i uh. just kind of got to explore yeah. I collect on top of it. Mom's got more, but there's a. Uh, yeah, there's one here. <laughs> and then I'm listening to Dean Martin. I mean, I was listening to Dean Martin. Yeah. I really like this little box he's got here that stores all the. These are 45s, is what uh -huh. you said? Yeah. Stevie Wonder. Bad Company. Rolling Stones, Faces album, uh, Electric Light Orchestra, little Jeff Lynne Love. It's got Stevie several Wonder. Stevie Wonders yeah. and lots of Kenny Rogers. <laughs> some uh, Dino Ross. Fleetwood Mac. Yeah, you got some good music going on there, my man. Some Johnny D. Are you excited yeah. to get the record player? I am. You know, it's been so. It's been probably more than twenty-five years since I've listened to any of this. Yeah. So it's gonna be fun to listen. To. I think it's fun. I'm excited. 
We ordered the record player from Amazon and it arrived just a few days later and we were so excited to listen to records on it and we've been listening to so much music and I'm so excited to go to flea markets and thrift stores and find new records. This was a good idea I had, wasn't it? Remember this song? There's a new day that will come again tomorrow. There's a new day to wash away the pain. <laughs> There's a new day to take away your sorrow. Washed out by the rain Darling, you've got to keep Holding on through the night Cause I promise you Hey guys, I totally forgot to film an outro for this video. I want to take a moment to thank you all so much for continuing to support my channel and watch my videos. It really means so very much to me. I'm currently in Florida with my friend Kristen. Um, if you don't follow my other channel, A Little Blessed Life, hopefully I will soon post this trip on there. We're doing something really fun, something I really wanted to do for a long time. We were doing a 5K at Disney on Friday morning. Um, and I think it's going to be really fun, so we're super excited. But anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.